In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to turn on or off pop-up and sound notifications in Microsoft Teams. Whether you're looking to reduce distractions or ensure you never miss an important update, adjusting your notification settings can be crucial to your workflow in Teams. To begin, you'll first want to sign into your Microsoft Teams account. If you're not already signed in, head over to the Teams app or web page and enter your credentials. Once signed in, you'll be greeted by the Teams interface, which is typically centered around your dashboard and recent activity. Look towards the top right of the screen. You'll notice three dots, often referred to as the More Options or Ellipsis menu. Give these dots a click. Now that you've opened the menu, a drop-down list will appear, offering you several options. What we're interested in here is the Settings menu. Click on Settings to proceed. With the settings window open, you'll see a list of customizable sections on the left hand side. These sections allow you to tailor various aspects of Teams to better suit your needs. Locate and click on the notifications and activity option. This is where you gain control over the alerts you receive within Teams. The notifications and activity section provides a comprehensive list of notification types and their current settings. You might see options for chat notifications, team mentions or banner alerts among others. Microsoft Teams allows you to personalize these settings extensively so you can decide when you want to be alerted with a pop-up, a sound or both. If you're aiming to focus, you might want to reduce the number of notifications or the type that includes audible alerts. Conversely, if being informed in real time is essential, ensure those notifications are armed with both visual and sound cues. As you adjust these settings, keep in mind your typical workflow and communication needs. For those who primarily work in meetings, reducing the number of pop-up interruptions could enhance concentration. On the other hand, if you're waiting on an urgent document or communication, having sound notifications on is beneficial. Once you're satisfied with your settings, simply close the settings menu. The changes you make will be saved automatically, so there's no additional confirmation needed. Your Teams environment should now reflect the new notification preferences you've set up. And there you have it, you've successfully customized your Microsoft Teams notifications, ensuring they're perfectly tailored to match your work habits and preferences. I hope this guide helps you create a more streamlined and efficient working environment in Teams. If you have any questions or need further clarification, feel free to reach out or leave a comment below. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more helpful tips and tutorials.